What is going on you guys? Brandon here aka Brawadis and if you couldn't tell from the title above this is not going to be a vlog, challenge, prank, it's not going to be any of that. This is more of a serious video uh, explaining why me and Lawrence do not hang out anymore. Okay so if you watched Lawrence's last video it was a QA, and a and one of the questions was why don't you and Brandon hang out anymore? Well actually before I start this video I just want to say that Lawrence is my boy, Lawrence is my friend. So whatever I say during this video, don't take it with the intention of me trying to make Lawrence look bad. Or don't, don't like, I'm not trying to make Lawrence look bad at all. I'm not trying to throw shade at him at all. I'm just telling you guys facts of a story. Like, so don't think, no, Lawrence is my boy. I'm telling you guys straight up right now. I love that dude. I love Lawrence. So I'm going to say how it is. So one of the questions in his Q&A was, why don't you and Brandon kick it anymore? And his answer was... His answer was, it's not because he's busy. It's not because he's busy with school. He only goes two days a week. Um, it's not because we have opposite schedules. It's because of it's because he has a girlfriend. And to me, I mean, I'm saying this in the nicest way. I felt like that was bullshit because although that plays a part in it, there are many reasons why we don't kick it anymore. And he failed to mention the other reasons. He left it at that. And I feel like that's not fair to me because it makes me come off as a douche. And it's not fair to my girlfriend because she has never, like, tried to control me and tell me who to hang out with or who not to hang out with. So I'm going to tell you guys the real reason. So, um, yeah, I wouldn't be addressing this if I didn't. Like, I was just sitting here and I got my Twitter mentions started blowing up. People telling me, like, people calling me a dick for cutting off a friendship over a girl. And people telling me, oh, bros before hoes. And in my head, I'm like, wait, what? What just happened? Till one of them said, watch Lawrence's video. He pretty much called you whip for your girlfriend and you cut off your friendship for that. I'm like, what? So I watched Lawrence's video and you guys saw the part. Brandon, why we don't really hang out anymore? And I'm finally going to answer for you guys. This is like, I'm just being real. I'm not like trying to throw a shade or a hate on anything whatsoever. But... The main reason why me and Brandon don't hang out anymore is because he has a girlfriend. It's not really because he has school or we're on different schedules. He goes to school two days out of five days, and I have free time. I'm always, like, hanging out with Brian. I used to kick it with both of them at the same time. But I would mainly say that we don't kick it anymore just because he has a girlfriend. And I'm So I want to clear it up because I just got off a 55-minute phone call with Lawrence where... We talked about it and we came to an agreement that he maybe shouldn't have answered that question like that because although that's some truth, that's not the full truth. Here's the reason why. So me and Lawrence would kick it a lot. You know, we'd see, we would see each other multiple times. We would go out to eat and stuff. And then I got a girlfriend. So what's expected with adding somebody into your life? It's expected that you, you might see your friends a little less. So let's say I was seeing Lawrence like four times a week. That got cut down to once or twice a week. But we were still on good terms and we would still see each other. So, um, I mean, every true friend know like, they're not going to complain. Like, a girlfriend is a human being. It's not just, it's I'm not getting a stray dog. A girlfriend is not a stray dog where you make your girlfriend and throw her on the side of the road and still hang out with all your friends. No, you got to like cut down on a little and make time to hang out with your girlfriend because as as an important piece that Lawrence is in my life as my best friend, Jackie is also an important piece in my life um, as my girlfriend. So you got to make time for the both of them, which is why we did not stop hanging out because of Jackie. I did not cut off any friends because of Jackie. Jackie had nothing to do with this. If the question was, why did you and Brandon used to kick it a lot? but you kicked it kind of less when he got a girlfriend, then it would make sense because he got a girlfriend and he had to make time for her. But the question was, why did you and Brandon stop kicking it? There's a smaller reason of, you know, my school started it, when me and him, him would hang out a lot. I wasn't in school. I was on break. I'm going to school almost full time. I also used to not take YouTube as seriously as I do now. I've been doing daily uploads and it's grind like it's it's a tough task. I'm staying up all night. I barely get any sleep trying to upload for you guys. So yeah, there's a small reason that I'm busy, but I'm not a bullshitter. I could have made time to hang out with Lawrence if I wanted to. And here's the real reason that I didn't want to talk about, but like it needs to be said because now people are assuming that I cut off Lawrence as a friend because of my girlfriend, which is not the case. I'm not that type of person. We just got off the phone with it. 
about this. I'm not going to go into detail because I feel like some things as as a vlogger and Lawrence being a vlogger, our privacy, we have no privacy. Everything we do is on record. Everything we do is on YouTube. But I still feel as if some things need to be a little private. So I'm going to mention that we got in an argument, but I'm not going to say what the argument was about. All you guys need to know is that me and Lawrence got in an argument on January 18th. So about a month and a half ago. And after that argument, I got no text from Lawrence, no call from Lawrence. I got no contact from Lawrence for one whole month. And to me, I was like, I was pretty bummed out. Like, I didn't see him for a month. I got no text, no call. I don't want to say he ignored me, but he just didn't talk to me over this argument. So the fact that he didn't mention that in his video is kind of like, it's kind of shitty to me because now I have all these people in my mentions. Some people actually unsub to me from YouTube saying, oh, I'm not watching you anymore. You chose your girl over a boy. Like, that's that's bullshit. You don't do that. I didn't do that. I'm going to tell you guys straight up. I'm going to take the fault in that once I made Jackie my girlfriend, yes, I saw Lawrence a little less, but that did not completely stop us from hanging out. We were still talking every day and maybe not seeing each other every day, but we would still see each other on occasion and we were on good terms. But that's expected when someone gets a girlfriend. You can't get a girlfriend and just have the same exact schedule as you had before. You're adding a huge piece into your life. So yes, we cut down hanging out. But he would still be in my vlogs. We would still go out and stuff. The reason why we haven't kicked it at all over from January 14th to March 1st. And I feel like he should have mentioned that in his answer because it's a huge part of the answer. If not the biggest, the main reason to why we don't hang out is because we got in an argument and me and Lawrence both know that we're stubborn. So we both made no effort to see each other. We ignored each other. And I know that's shitty of two best friends to do, but I feel like it's even a shittier thing to do to blame it all on me and my girlfriend because it makes it seem like I'm cutting off friends for a girl. And I don't do that. Like you see me hang out with Ollie and Jordan. Why? Because we didn't get in an argument. Not because I like I have a girlfriend whether I hang out with Ollie and Jordan, whether I see Lawrence. So I'm not trying to throw shade at Lawrence at all. I'm not trying to make him look bad. So I don't want any comments saying, oh, fuck Lawrence, he tried to make you look bad when that wasn't the truth. No, all I'm saying is simply that um, when the question was asked, why do you and Brandon not kick it anymore? His answer is, Instead of, oh, it's because he got a girlfriend. He even mentioned, he said, oh, and he's not really busy with school. He only goes two days out of five. I'm sorry, two, three, four, five days. I'm still almost going full time. So I don't know. I felt like that was uncalled for by him. The real or the main reason is because of that argument. And I don't want to say what the argument is because, like I said, some things don't need to be put on YouTube or social media. Some things can be kept between yourself. But that's the reason. And like, we agree. We just got off the phone. My first time talking to him in a month and a half. Like, yes, I understand it's bullshit that two best friends didn't talk over a small argument. But I feel like it's even bullshit or it's even worse that the first time we talked was over an answer that he gave to a question, not fully telling the truth. Um... So yeah, let me just run this through before I end this video. You know, I've been getting a million comments, me and Lawrence both. Why don't you guys kick it anymore? And I mean, I'm answering that right now. He answered it in his way saying that um, it's because I got a girlfriend. My girlfriend, babe, would you ever make me cut one of my friends off? No, you guys, I honestly, I don't want to hear about this because I've never put Brandon in a situation where I feel like he needs to change his friends or, like, ever. I even, I encourage him to hang out with Lawrence. There's, After their argument, all the time I encourage that. And it didn't happen because they both didn't want to talk to each other, so that's not my problem. I don't know why I'm in it. Take, you need some. But that is not why I don't kick anymore because I still kick it with my other friends. It's because we got in this argument... And we're both stupid, we're both stubborn, so we haven't settled the argument, and that's why. And I just don't get why he wouldn't mention that in his video, but but yeah, I'm going to take some fault in this too. When I started dating Jackie, I cut down on seeing Lawrence, but I, like that's expected. Like I said, you get a girlfriend, and you don't throw her on the side of the street. Like That's your girl. That's like, especially at my age, you're 20 years old, like... The girl that you're dating is not just, oh, let me just hang out there. No, like, this is serious. When you're dating at 20 years old, 
like this girl is actually something serious you have plans with her for the future and all this so like Yes, I cut down a little on hanging out with my friends, but I would still see my friends, including Lawrence. I would still go out to eat with Lawrence. I would still go out on Friday nights with Lawrence. Remember my vlogs were Fridays with Lawrence and everyone would know my Fridays at hanging out with Lawrence? I was dating Jackie at that time. That's not the reason why we stopped hanging out. Does it play a part in why we cut down? Yes, I'll be the first to admit and I'll take fault. I'm sorry if, if it's like... I guess I spend a little too much time with my girlfriend, but I would still make time for my friends. Like I said, my friends, including Lawrence, are a really important piece in my life, and Jackie's an important piece in my life, so I don't pick one or the other. I make time for both. Again, guys, like I said, I understand why he wouldn't want to mention our argument or, like, blah, blah, and I wouldn't care, like, whatever. You could put it on me and my girlfriend, but then I started having people actually unsub from me, and like unfollow me on Twitter and tweet to me saying, bro, you're a bitch. You dropped your friend for a girl. And in my head, I was like, no, 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 no. Like, this isn't right. Like, I can't, I have to address the situation. So Lawrence called me and we talked about it. And um, the main reason we haven't hung out and the reason to answer all your guys' questions of why don't you and Lawrence kick it, the truth is finally out. We got in an argument and we haven't spoke ever since then. And um, I appreciate what Lawrence is doing because in his video today, he's going to bring up that argument. Um, so at least I appreciate that. He's not going to leave it out. It's because of Jackie because it's not because of Jackie. And I hope you guys understand this. I hope if I lost some subscribers or some followers that I get them back after they see this video, if they do see it, because I don't think I deserve to lose followers for spending some time with a girl, let alone my girlfriend. Like this isn't some, you, I know the saying bros before hoes, but there's a difference. A hoe is, you know what a hoe is. Your girlfriend is not a hoe. If your girlfriend is a hoe, then why the hell is she your girlfriend? But, um, so yeah, I mean, it's sad, but that's why me and Lawrence don't hang out anymore. But I'm pretty sure after this fucking phone call we had, we settled most of it. Like, we're we're good. You're going to be seeing him in my vlogs, and I'm going to be in his vlogs. I'm probably going to kick his ass for fucking lying, for fucking bending the truth but i'm just joking i'm not gonna fucking kick his ass he would probably beat my ass he's fucking like six foot five but i'll probably like sucker punch him in the balls so um yeah we got in an argument and that is the reason why we don't talk but that's gonna change you know we're both fucking grown men we can settle this a different way i just don't feel like it was the right thing to do by giving the wrong answer on youtube but I'm done, guys. That's the reason me and Lawrence don't hang out anymore. But that's over with. Argument settled. And we're back to being friends. Guys, I just got off the phone again with Lawrence. Like a five-minute conversation. We were just laughing. And we just both came to agreement that we were both like... He shouldn't... He, he doesn't like... Regrets answering the question in that way. And... I regret not mentioning our argument before because I've tried to find ways out of it too. When people ask me, why don't you and Lawrence talk? I just say, oh, I'm too busy now. But you're never too busy for a best friend. Like I can say how I stay up all night editing vlogs and I don't get sleep. But that's your homie. Like if you really wanted to see your best friend. So I have fault in this too. Um, but, all, but I just hope that when I tell you guys that me and Lawrence would kick it a lot and then I met Jackie and we would still see each other but it would be a little less. I hope you guys don't take that the wrong way because you guys have to understand, especially you younger dudes who have never had a girlfriend. When you meet a girl like, and you make her your girlfriend, you have to hang out with her too. Like, You can't just make her your girlfriend and then just text her all day. No, you have to make time to hang out with her. So um, I hope you guys understand that. And other than that, me and Lawrence are on good terms right now. I'm fucking kill Lawrence for not talking to me for a month and a half when I do see him though. But um, I want to say I hope you guys enjoyed this video, but that's not the right thing to say. I hope you guys understand where me and Lawrence are both coming from, how we both handled this situation in the wrong way, how he put it on something that wasn't really the main reason, but at the same time, we should have just, for, we should have never let this small argument get between us. That's all I'm going to say. I love you guys all, Bro Watch Squad. You guys are the best fucking squad on YouTube.